Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial. Today we are going to learn about how to subscribe to the topics with the web browser using the Firebase cloud messaging. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel and if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So here you can see that we have this browser with the notification and you can see that we have a token. Okay, this is not yet started. So let's do the node server to start. Here we go with this. Um, in node i think server.js would be the file okay now here you can see check out the details automatically you can see about that the breaking new it will come over here okay just reload and here because i'm already run this project and i already subscribed to the topic okay so in the chrome also so here we go with this one so there is no error can so i just successfully to subscribe to the topic news and same to here subs subscribe to the topic news both browser has subscribed to the topic news right so now if i go and just close this browser okay and let's go with the i'm just having the google and let's try to run again sending the message again and here we go with the you can see two notifications okay check breaking news check out the latest updates so two notifications why because one tab is in chrome one tab is in firefox okay so both have subscribed to the news topic so definitely both get the notifications okay so let's dive into the code level how i have implemented this one okay so first of all we go with the javascript part so here we go with the js part let's hide this so this is our js part notification demo right index.html okay so here we have notification demo and uh, here we added our initialize the app and import the initialize app from this firebase and import this get messages get token from this firebase messaging okay then we have to declare your credentials with the firebase config right and how to get this firebase config you have to log in with the firebase console so here we go with firebase console switch the project actually the project is from this firebase testing and here we go with project settings and journal here you get the details in the web part right so here we go with the details just copy and paste this you will get this firebase config correct so here we go with this one firebase config now we have to require the vapid key so let's go and just create the vapid key also so it will come over here in the cloud messaging so if you haven't created just go cloud messaging and create this over here okay so you can create the new one also so here this key i'm going to add it over here right so initialize the firebase messaging with the vapid key and register the service with the worker so this is our service and to get the token over here when i get the current token i will go with the subscribe user to topic okay so when i when the token receive I, uh, the browser whatever the client browser we have just i will subscribe to the topic which is news one whatever topic you can add else no registration token available okay and uh, here uh, so here i'm calling the api that is async function request notification permission so we have to grant the notifications permission or not so this is for that code right and the last one that is get the device token from the SCMM subscribe the user from the topic okay so this is my api that i have made in the node.js okay and the post method and then it will give you the message that subscribe to the topic else fail to subscribe to topic and error to that one okay so if i go to my node.js project package.json file main one so this these are the things that i have installed so make sure you have to install these dependencies after this my main file that is server.js file so this is express firebase admin body parser path and the course so this is service account file how to get the service account file so if i go over here and service accounts to so make sure you have to create the service account file whatever file it, it will give you just copy paste and download and uh, put it over here okay so i have put it over here right so this is loading so here we create new 
private key so automatically it will give you that file okay so you have to put it over here in list as a fat base admin sdk with the service account so make sure you have to add it and this is your project firebase okay so here you need to add our project id so here we go with this one here real time database so this is our this one so just copy and add it over here okay and after this uh, initialize the express course body parser then this is our api subscribe to the topic so await admin dot messaging dot subscribe to the topic the token and the topic you have to send then send the response and if something went wrong send the error part also okay and here we are going to send the message to the topic this is my function where we are trying to send the notifications to the uh, who's who, whoever subscribe to the topic notification title body and the topic okay and here we go with this one await admin dot messaging dot send successfully send the message error sending the message and what we are sending the message news breaking news check out the latest updates okay and this is server that we have to run on the port correct so by doing this one you are get to know about that you are already subscribed to the topic and particular notifications to whoever subscribed to the topic send accordingly okay so this is how we are going to send the notifications to a topic via web browser and without any query in that you let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to like share and comment on my video have a nice day i think one file i just skip out that is sws.js so sorry for that so here you need to add the notification on click event listener forget the notifications okay so this is the file for the sw.js okay any doubt any query do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day